Hey guys, Austin here, and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft New World. Now, if you missed the previous episode, we basically um, captured a ton of YouTubers into the Pokeballs with using the Pokeball mod. As you can see, we've captured about nine of them, so I want to start off this episode with capturing a few more of them. As you know, Furious Destroyer and Bomby have been stuck in this hole for... A long time, and regarding what we'll be doing today's episode, they can no longer be in here. Sorry, guys, I'm gonna have to basically capture you. So, first off, we're going to be making, if I remember how to do this recipe correctly, we are gonna be making two Pokeballs. And I got all the materials ready just so I'd be prepared for this, and I messed up. So, I'm gonna be searching Pokeballs right now. And I want to say, if you guys are excited and want to see more of this series, please hit that like button to show your support. And let's capture some YouTubers. So, first up. Did I even? Oh, he got it in. I forgot that happens. And I'm stuck in here, but I can... Oh, that's prom. That's prom. That's prom. Didn't mean to do that. Sorry. I forgot if you hit them, they actually, like, aggroed you. And I did not mean to do that. Alright. First up, one caught. And, Bommy, you are... Second one caught. Now that's taken care of, we can finally, after many years... Not really years, but of that hole being filled, we can... Or, em uh, I don't even know what I'm saying. After that hole being empty, we can finally fill it. So, let's grab one stone brick out of here. And let's fill it. And we're finally doing construction on the house. Bam. Done. Alright, that was the episode. See you guys later. Just kidding. But if you're wondering what we're actually doing today is construction on the house. I know I've said I've been doing it for a while, and today is the right time to do it. But again, before we do that, we have a few more things we need to craft. Well, I should say one more thing. And you're probably wondering why I have all this wood in my inventory. Because we're going to be using that today to craft our selves another layer of the house so what did I also want to craft yes the feed bag I've been getting pretty annoyed with the um oak wood planks just being in my inventory and taking up space so we're actually gonna craft the feed bag which is leather a diamond string and a chest so if we craft that right here basically its function is it stays in your inventory but it also can hold multiple sections for food for all your different pets so if you have two pets and you need to feed them this will take up one slot where you would normally need two slots for the food. And we also need to make a pen for a horse. We might do that this episode if we still have time, but right now we need to start construction. So, let's grab all of our materials out, and I already kind of have an idea of what I'm going to do. It's more like the second floor is going to be some sort of like a lookout tower slash watchtower. And yes, I know the wood will not really complement this cherry wood, but hey, like, doesn't really matter, right? But... Let's start building. So I guess we're going to have this right here. We'll climb up here and... Now, how do I want to... Oh, I actually wanted it right here. That's right. Now I remember. I wanted this here. We need to chop this back down. Oh, and I forgot. This thing breaks like crazy. We're already losing wood. All right, let's put that back. Why is my... I don't know why it's doing that. It's kind of hard to click on the items. But let's repair that. Okay, that's repaired. Put this right here. We climb up here. Let's put a final ladder piece down. And I must say, this is my first time actually, like, building on camera, so don't expect, like, a flawless, like, recording thing. I don't know even what to call it, but let's get our, um, fence to put down. So we'll put it down right like this. We actually want the trap door to be here, so that is not a trap door. This is the trap door, so how will I do this? Do I actually need to break this? Yeah, I do. Okay. So I'll have a trap door here. We'll have our lookout post like right about like this that seems about right we'll have it cover the majority of the house and we are actually out of fence did not think about that and i like the door animation just look at that how it like slowly opens and closes but we still need sticks we do not have sticks i'm going to have to make more sticks so oh we actually do have sticks might be all right time to make some fence so if i go to uses here let's see where is the different fence look at all the stuff i can make with wood geez all right, there it is right there. Let me just shift click, and I think, you know what, we'll just make all of it. I don't think I need 48, but you never know. Oh, now I have to redo this, because if it's on this side, I will not be able to get up here properly, so I have to put the gate on this side so it opens like that. Yeah, that's perfect. Okay, so we want it to go actually around, so I'm going to make it go like this over here, back this way, and actually wait. Again, let me just redo this. And yes, the, the roof is going to break. Be prepared for that. The roof will break. And there's really nothing I can do about it because the blocks are so, like, delicate, I guess the word would be. But, again, hey, not my fault. And we can't really get attacked unless it becomes nighttime because there's not really any hostile creatures to attack us with, I, w I would say. But, hey. 
I don't know. And we got this here. This is kind of going to be like an opening issue. So I think I'm actually going to put this right here and build like that. Then I know it's kind of a little bit off now, but I think it's fine. And if we up, oh, there goes some more wood. We'll fix that later. And oops, didn't want to open my chest, but build, 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 build. We actually do want to come down here, grab this wood, repair that, go back up. Let's see if we can make our door work now. And I, I do apologize for this being a semi-boring episode. I mean, hey, I'm interested in it, but if you guys don't want to see any more building episodes, tell me and I'll be happy to build off camera because then I can really concentrate on the build and not worry about being watched by you people. But hey, it doesn't matter. Alright, so we are almost finished. It's actually becoming nighttime, so that's bad. And we actually are short by two of them, and we don't have any more birch wood. If we go into our wood chest right here, as you can see, we are actually out of birch wood. And I try making stuff out of dead wood, but you can't do anything with dead wood, which I didn't even realize that, but I'm trying to think of how to do this. I mean, right now we could just put down this fence, but we don't have any more. And you know what? I think I'll just make a fence with the um, spruce if I remember correctly I think it's like this yep we'll use two spruce wood planks or for the fence and then when we need to fix it we can down the road or we'll actually see if I like it I might just no that looks horrible okay but we will fix that down the road but for now it'll have to stay like that put the last fence post back in here now let's go up and check out this looks so since it's nighttime this actually is perfect not like we have a bow or anything but we can actually see the entire world and everything that's spawning. And for some reason, do I have this on? It's on hard. Why is it only... Oh, wait. No, I see a skeleton. Okay. Yep, everything seems to be spawning normally. Close our trap door just so it looks more um, effective. Let's eat our steak. And we need to do something about that area down there. That needs to be fixed soon anyway. And sorry, we sadly we cannot um move the fence back one more because that would be in the way and... Actually, let me see how that looks. If I break this right here, let me see if I actually can just place it like on top like this. Can I still open the chest? Uh, you know what? I think I might actually break all the wood that's available. No, I think I might actually keep that like that because that looks pretty cool. And there was one more. Do I not have any more cherry wood? Please tell me I do. Okay, I do. Thank goodness. If I did not have... It's on the floor right there. Whatever. I was going to say, if we didn't have any more cherry wood, that'd be bad, considering our house is revolving around cherry wood. Now, if I actually check my feed bag, I'm pretty sure... Oh, he's not eating it. Strange. And I didn't put my leather back, but whatever. But, is this two more birch? When did I get this? That's strange. I don't think... That means I actually made a perfect amount? No way. I made a perfect amount. Perfect. Now, let me see if I can break this and make that over like that. So, is that even? Not in the slightest. And it kind of makes my picture on the minimap not look so disturbing. If you don't know what I mean, then don't worry about it. But, yeah. So, let's actually check outside. What is out here right now? Oh, we got crickets. That's what's all around. I need to turn that off. How do I turn off passive mobs? Wait. Minimap features. How do I get to you? Exit options. Minimap settings. Um, Display hostile mobs. Yes. Display mobs, no. But it has hostile mobs on, so is there still displaying of the... Yeah. Yeah, okay. Turned off the regular s display of them, and there's actually creepers and zombies around. Let me just kill a little bit. It's been a while since I've actually, like, killed some things on here. And for good reason, because I almost blew up. Alright, we're getting inside, we're getting inside. It's already too dangerous. Close the door, and we're good. Okay, we can't get in. Why was that swordsman attacking us? I don't think he was. I think he just happened to be walking by, but we actually got some more money's around flesh and oh we can make a poison orb with this i didn't know that oh yeah and also if you guys are wondering we did add the um i forgot you cook rotten flesh too we added the nether lucky block mod to this game so if you check we do have a nether nether rack sorry that's weird we have the nether lucky block right here which is crafted with coal and nether rack so checking to see if we actually have any but i doubt we will i know we have coal do we actually have netherrack? We have one piece of netherrack. That's funny. Now, we still need to build another portal, which, again, do we have obsidian? Didn't look to check. We have nine obsidian, so... Could we actually... I don't know if we could. I No, I think we need 12. I think we even need 12. Not entirely sure, but I think we need 12. This is so weird now with not him being in this hole here. 
But again, we will make the YouTubers thing later. That'll be a totally separate house or something underground. It might be something underground, but there's a mine shaft like right there, so that might be a problem. And since it's nighttime, I think I'm gonna sleep. And there's monsters nearby, go figure. And I actually hear spiders. Are they up? Oh my gosh, there's actually like mobs up here. And I just realized this is a horrible place to fight mobs because you're breaking the house. That I I never even thought of that. Well, we killed it, but pandemonium struck the house, and our entire roof has gotten obliterated by me. I might actually say, yeah, maybe that is not a good idea to fight mobs up there. But on the risk of us almost dying, we actually got a nice helmet. So I'm just gonna put that in there. And yes, I do know we need to do more chests. Um, inventory organizing because we so far do not have any. We need to make a bow. I say we make a bow. What kind of bows do we have in this mod? And it better not just be lucky ones. Mostly lucky ones. How do we make guardians bow? Cannot make. We have a bow. We have weird staffs in that. We can't make any of the weird lucky bows. At least I don't think. Hmm. Yeah, you can't make any of these bows. Can we make... I know we can make the normal bow, but I think that's it. So yeah, I'm going to make a bow real quick and enchant it. So all we need really need is string, which I'm going to grab right now. We got string and we need sticks. And I believe we don't have that in our inventory. Do we actually run out of sticks? We're going to have sticks. If only this devil was useful. Nope, we got sticks. Never mind. I put them in the wrong chest. That's why. I Nope, nope. Sorry. So I did not mean to right click you, horse. I, I don't like how he likes standing on crafting tables. But all right, let's make this. So if it's like this and like this. Wow, I actually made a bow in the first shot. I have to, I thought I'd have to redo that. All right. So, before we put it in there, let's enchant. And you're on the... Now you're on that. And, of course, we need lapis to enchant, which I always forget we need. I should probably put a chest for that. Don't worry. We'll make an enchantment table room soon also. So, power one, power one, or power one? G. wonder which one I should choose. The most expensive one, of course. Power one. <laughs> I don't get the point of that. But, hey, we got a bow now. Put that right here. So, basically, what that does is allow us to block while aiming with the bow. So, we actually can multitask with it. And, of course, we don't want to fire. We can just change that up. But, we now have an inventory we can put our arrows in. Is there a quiver in this mod pack? Let me see. Quiver there is. There's two. There's the quiver pet and the regular quiver. I can actually make a quiver. Let me see if that works well. If I make a quiver... I think this won't work though. Let me see. So if I get the arrows, put them in here. Oh wait, I think I have to craft them into it. Yeah, there we go. So if I get that, now can I put this in here? Oh. See that at all. If I do that, it does work. Strange. Okay. Quiver doesn't work. Scrap that. Can I take the arrows out of here? I can't. Let me just fire one real quick. All right. So quiver doesn't work. Let's throw that in here. Let's grab our arrows. Put them in here like we had them before. So, of course, that doesn't work, sadly. But, hey, at least we got our balcony done. And I'm trying to think, what else should we do in this episode? I know you're probably like, wow, you didn't even really like accomplish much for a house. You just added to the rooftop, which only seems to show... Whenever we have, whenever we're up there, because when you come back down here, it doesn't. Oh, it does. No, it doesn't. It has to like zoom in and zoom out. That's so weird. So in a way, you might not even notice we did anything with the house unless you check. And do you want in here? Oh, he's attacking me. Jeez, I didn't even know that. And I really need to watch when I attack stuff so randomly. And we got thrown in the air. That is a hostile mob or whatever it's called. Rare. Yeah, no, sorry. That is a hostile creeper. Okay. Nope, sorry, going to bed. I know the creeper will still be there, but still, we're going to bed. Maybe daytime. I wonder if those swordsmen just attack during the night. I don't know, I've never had a run in with them during it, so who knows. But hey, I think we're about to end the episode. No, the episode's too short. We can't end it yet. What is this? We're only 14 minutes into this thing. How can I make this seem longer? And I apologize for the episodes being so short. It's just these top, like the topics that we're doing is just doesn't seem to be ending. And I can't do the enchantment table room thing because we don't have that set up. Unless we want to do it on the roof. You know what? I think for now we're going to do it on the roof. Let's grab this stuff right now and let's do it. We only got 10 bookshelves. Can we make more? Do we have the technology? We have wood. We don't have books. Is there some weird way of making books? Because I don't think we got the stuff to make it. So... 
Paper and leather. So we have leather. Oh my creepers, that's terrifying. And they keep using their abilities on me. So we have leather in our inventory. Do we have paper though? I don't think we do. No, it wouldn't be in here. It would be in this chest. Do we have it? We actually do. Wow, okay. So let's make that into paper. That'll be six paper. And so that's going to give us two more books, which isn't even enough for a bookshelf. Okay. Well, bummer on that. Um, so I guess we're just doing what we have. So hopefully the creeper won't fling me in the air while I'm up here. So how do I want to do this? Is this? This isn't perfectly even. Of course it isn't perfectly even. That just makes it harder. And that is uh, Ultra Poisonous Creeper of Decay. Okay. Um, how am I going to do this? The only way I can think is two enchantment tables. But for now, we only have one. It's so bad. And then it won't really be a lookout tower. You know what? No, we're making a separate room for it. We're not worrying about it now. Paul, sorry for it. Sorry for that misleading concept, but we cannot do this yet. We need time. And we do not have the power yet to do it. That being said, I want to put some crafting tables up there just because I feel like I always need crafting tables anywhere I go. So let me go up here again. We're going to put a crafting table right there. Crafting table right here. And a crafting table right there is no center, never mind. So we're going to have two crafting tables up here. So again, for emergency crafting, and I guess we can leave that open. I mean, nothing's going to happen if we leave it open. And how much money are we looking at? Oh, I'm actually going to organize the money on camera so you guys can see how I do it. Okay, so basically what I do is, as you know, you can just compare it like you would in real life dollars. You can just combine them together. I mean, I wish you could do that in real life, but... So we take the five and you hit R to show the recipe, so it shows the five ones. You just hold down the question mark to shift click it, and bam, you got all your ones turned into fives. Next up, you can do tens, same way, 32 tens. Next, we have 56 fifties, and finally we have 100, 29 hundreds. But we're not done there. Turn that into five 500 R bills and turn that into two thousand dollar bills so now we have our change i guess you could say as organized as possible to trade so the most money we have like the highest bill stature is a thousand we can go way higher than that but um i like how it gives a random enchantment book but doesn't have a recipe nor a type but um yep i think that is going to be no that's not it for the episode we are doing stuff we have the stuff we're getting in an astral lucky potion a regular lucky potion an Astro Lucky Block and two Dark Side Lucky Blocks and we're going to open them. And we need to, I'm thinking about crafting them off camera. I might next episode, if not, I'll just get the resources on camera. But I kind of want to, we'll get a Spiral one too. I kind of want to open these. But, like not open them, but I want to accumulate more of them. But sadly can't do that yet. So wait, don't throw those in there. Throw everything we own so far in here. Let's do that. Take our armor off because we don't want to. Well, we'll die either way. But let's just put this in here. Let's go to our best zone, our lucky zone. I'm actually gonna end off the episode in the lucky zone because, as you know, when we teleport back. It does that weird glitch that I can't fix, and I thought I was gonna do it for a second there, but didn't. So we're good. So first stop, regular lucky potion. What are you gonna give us? Bunnies. That are all gonna suffocate. Wait, if they suffocate, they'll give me their meat. AKA toast because bunnies. I only got one raw rabbit. And an overwhelming number of toast. Rabbits, I feel for you. Like, if you can only give me toast in your life, then you should have died. <laughs> but, Astral Lucky Potion, what are we going to get? Lava and Fire, nice. I believe that was a lucky one, too. It might have been random, but I also hear a baby zombie. And, oh, is this one of those blocks from last time? Yeah, it's the starry blocks from the Astral Lucky block we opened last time, but I guess I never picked it up. Oops. Hope next up we're doing dark side since they're the weakest. So next up we got one stick. Knockback 20 home run stick. Nice weapon. We got a ton of die. I will take that because who knows when we're actually going to need it. Next up. Oh, I don't know what's stronger. I want to say ash or spiral is weaker. So what are we going to get? We're going to get a ton of rainbows with. I forgot to put this stuff in my inventory away. But let's kill all the rainbows. Get their meat. I don't know why I'm saying rainbows, because it's not Mr. Rainbow, but they still have meat. Wait, come here, red sheep. I need to kill you and get your... And I forgot all the sheep dropped that one, like, multicolor changing wool, which I'm starting to get a lot of. Where is it? Yeah, right here, rainbow wool. I'm starting to get a lot of it. I probably should do something about it. What is it from? Loot plus plus mom. What is the bread from? Loot plus plus. Okay. And we got one diamond block. So our final block of the day is astral. 
What are we going to get, good or bad? Leave it in the comments section. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, open it, and we got... Oh, no, 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 no. I'm out, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. How do you get out of here? Teleport home. No. If you didn't know what those were, those were baby astral mages. I can't recall if I fought them in my um, Lucky Block series, but basically they're bad news. They light you on fire, they give you wither effect as you saw, and yeah. Not not a good time. But hey, we finished that off, and I guess we can chuck this in the furnace to s cook. Can we do anything with the toast again? Nope, we're just going to throw it in our food chest because now we have an unlimited supply of toast. You go through the toast quickly too, it's not even like that edible, but I mean we got it. And I guess I'll organize the rest of the stuff off camera, so I guess I'm going to end off the episode here. So, oh, I just realized we made it home, we didn't have the weird glitch. Well, that's good. But, um, anyways guys, thank you for watching. If you did enjoy, I love the pickaxe, how it's just sticking on my body like that. But, um, if you did enjoy, please hit that like button, show your support. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more Minecraft modded content like so. And I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.